We had some bad days here in the beginning because we couldn't understand people and we couldn't say what we wanted to say. I think initially the, the struggle was just getting past the frustration of not understanding anything and then as we got it more into the language it's just the frustration of learning and remembering all the things you've, you've learned in class and being able to recall them when you're in an actual conversation with people. And it was such a blessing to me to live in this beautiful place of God's creation. Beautiful beaches, we have beautiful mountains, and I think the people here in this city are the most beautiful people in the world. They are warm, they, they have so much patience for people that don't speak well, but want to communicate. I think everybody on the team is now at a point where we're very comfortable having conversations with Brazilians and speaking in Portuguese and living our daily lives that way, and I think it's, it's amazing that we've made it that far in, in a year. Sunday, um, the inaugural Sunday was really a culmination of a lot of work and a lot of time. I mean, years. We talk, we talk about just the last few months that we've been working on, you know, specific things, but really years of fundraising, dreaming, planning, you know, recruiting other team members and, and all kinds of things. It was incredible to watch the people as they were just walking in. It was great for us to just be able to greet them. Uh, and see the excitement in their eyes as this new church was being planted uh, in their neighborhood. It was incredible to see the church filled uh, when you know we'd seen it uh, without tile, without paint, without lights. Uh, it looked a little bit like a cave, and uh, and then to see it um, filled with people that were worshiping, worshiping God, it was really neat to see that. There were some people who came just because of a new sign that got put out on the street. There were some people who I handed a flyer to Friday night and Sunday morning they were there asking where was their new friend Jill that they met on Friday. These people are excited about God. These people are passionate about anything they do and they want to know more. It's amazing to think that eight years ago I decided I wanted to be part of a mission work and then five years ago decided I wanted to be a part of this mission work and to think that um, a lot of people think that we as a team have spent one year on the field and that that's the amount of investment we've made in this. But for most of us, it's been a four or five year commitment that, that we've already put time and money and effort into, into doing all of this stuff for the past four or five years. And so to finally see it, finally be here for this day and see it, it was a, it was a great day for all of us. I've been blessed to be able to help a lot with the music on our team. We've learned a lot of different songs. We're trying to do a really good blend of Brazilian songs, songs that were written here, and then songs that were translated from worship songs in the States. It's, it's exciting to see how much Brazilians love to, to sing praises to God, and so that's one of the areas that I'm working with, and I'm excited uh, about what we've, what we've begun, and I'm even more excited about uh, just being able to praise God even more with more Brazilian brothers and sisters. I helped April upstairs with the children's ministry. I am puppet number two, so I'm excited about that. Um, and it went really well. April was so organized, had everything ready, so it made the day go so smoothly. It was really a great time. During our Bible Hour time, the children will become descobridores. This means that the children will become discoverers because they will discover God, Jesus, and stories of the Bible. Last Sunday was amazing. I felt like, oh, finally, we started. And I'm excited about this next Sunday, you know, just there's a routine now. We get to meet every Sunday as a church and we get to, to build relationships. And I'm just so excited. It, it was beyond my expectations and I'm so thankful to God for that. And I can only, I can only hope that we carry this through many, many years, you know. I,